Rich DeMarco at Mikey Stadium following the 2014 Army football black and gold spring game. It was the gold defeating the black 20 to 14. Joined by Tony Giovanelli of the black team. Although you came up short, Tony, quite a day for you. And the way you were used, catching passes out of the backfield, running the football, a couple of acrobatic catches. Tell me about the experience playing in this game and how exciting it was today. Um, it was exciting because it was the first game time experience that we got to have like as a unit with the new coaching staff. Um, we ran a whole lot of stuff. Usually we stick to some of the stuff that we did during the week. This week we incorporated everything that we learned to try to culminate it all in. We're just trying to move the ball down the field, so it was a good experience. You talked about the plays that were being incorporated for you. Your number called a lot. Tell me about how you were utilized today and maybe over the spring how it was building up to that. Um, well, every, every slot that we have, we believe that we can all perform the same task. So today I think it was just luck of the draw that the plays were called my way. I and mean, we call certain plays in the field in the boundary and it just happened to be in the boundary when I was on that side. So any, any of the slots could have done what I could have done today. Well, you utilized, though, a couple of nice plays, juggling one catch, tiptoeing down the sideline on a couple. How did you feel out there when you were put in those situations? Um, I felt good today. Today I studied last night, and it was the first time I felt comfortable knowing what I was doing, so it kind of let me cut loose today. I mean, credit to AJ, too. A lot of those passes were just converted from nothing, so good reads. Jeff Munkin has said really the majority of the offensive installation this spring has been terminology, but what differences have you seen on maybe the things that are going to be able to be done with this offense? Saw a lot of shotgun today, maybe than we have seen in the past. Um, we spread the field a lot more than we did. Uh, we were a very compact offense with the triple option. Um, we have that aspect of it with this offense, but we also have, like you said, the shotgun, or we have wide formations, trips and stuff, and we spread the field a lot more, giving the defense more to worry about than just putting 10 in the box. And now joined by the victorious starting quarterback in the 2014 Army football spring game, and that's Matt Kaufman of the goal team. First off, congrats on quarterbacking this squad to victory. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. The honorary coaches and Brigadier General Richard Clark, the commandant, tell me uh, your interactions with him, able to make him want to know now as a head coach. <laughs> it's a... Uh it's great to play for you know, General Clark. He's a great guy, and uh, you know, the whole entire court looks up to him. And it's just great to you know to play for you know General Clark, and it's just great to get a victory for him. And hopefully, hopefully he's happy. How about your performance? You get out to the 17 nothing lead, had that beautiful touchdown pass down the right side, an acrobatic catch made for it. Tell me about your performance. How you felt out there? I felt great. You know, I I I give it all to my offensive line, and my receivers, and my receivers made some great catches. That ball, that touchdown pass, I, it wasn't a good ball. Uh, Paros made a great catch on it. Um, my offensive line protected me. I really had no trouble in the pocket, you know. So I was able to make, de you know, decent throws in my receivers. My receivers made great catches. If it wasn't for them, you know, it'd be a different story. How comfortable are you out there? How comfortable has this spring been for you? Through a couple of touchdowns in a scrimmage a couple of weeks ago, you've you've had success out there in scrimmage-like conditions. How comfortable has this been for you? It, it's 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 a process. You know, every practice, every game, you know, I get more comfortable. But it's just because of how great the coaches are and how ready they get us for these competitions and how well they explain things and how well practices run. I, you know, the, the coaches get me get all of us ready actually. And I think I see it. You know, all spring we've been improving, and I, I, it's, it's coaching staff. I asked about General Clark a moment ago, but just tell me about the competitiveness going into a game like this. I know it's a spring game, and really the winner is Army football if everyone is out there and there's success, and they're, they're, you limit the amount of injuries. But how much competitiveness was there between the teams? It was. It's always it's always a big competition when you have game-like game situations, and then when you split the, the superintendent and the commandant, you know, it's, it's, it's a big deal. So, you know, when you're playing for the comm, you know, you want to win from him, you know, because he's your boss. And so... Um, I mean, the competition was great, and every time you have a different color jersey in front of you, 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 you want to kick their butts, but, I mean, it was great. It was great. Well, Matt, you had an opportunity today, and you seized it. Congratulations on pulling out the victory for the Gold Squad. Best of luck the rest of this offseason. We'll talk to you come fall. Yes, sir. Thank you. Appreciate it. That's Matthew Kaufman, quarterback of the gold team here in today's 2014 Army football black and gold spring game. It's the gold winning it by the final of 20-14. Making a victor out of honorary head coach, the Commandant of the United States Military Academy, Brigadier General Richard Clark. On a beautiful Saturday afternoon here at Mikey Stadium, West Point, New York, at the Army Football Spring Game. For Night Vision, I'm Rich DeMarco.